where you go. I can't find it to hit you do. Sarah's wearing daddy's hat. Mm -hmm. You like it? Yeah. Looks good. <laughs> So today we're going to the library and we're going to sign up for what's called, I think it's Dolly Parton's Imagination Library, where you can sign up and you get a, a free book every month for your child from age zero to age five. So that's pretty awesome that um, she's doing that. And so we're going to go sign up for that. They're doing it at our local library. Made it to the library. I All right, thank you. That makes it a lot easier. All right, go straight up to that table. fish away. Go away, Shadow, cried the bear. But Bear Shadow would not go away. It stayed right there. Okay, said Bear. If you won't go on your own, then I'll just have to get rid of you. Hey guys, I just wanted to briefly touch on what we did at the library today. We went to our local library branch and they had the um an opportunity for their residents to sign up for the imagination uh library by dolly parton and it's a really neat program you go and you sign up it's free all you have to do is sign up and promise to read to your kids and that's all it takes and and you would get for each child one book each month until they are five years old. So if they're just born, they'll get a book every month all the way up until they're five. And I think that's a really good program. And the first book is the um, the little engine that could, you know, where I think I can, I think I can. That's the very first book every child gets. And the last book they said it would be ready for kindergarten, which is perfect because they're five years old and they should be starting kindergarten at that time. And, um, and I think that is really a really good program and that's a lot of books for a child to get every month and something to look forward to and they're very conversational pieces um sarah picked out a um shadow book for this little bear and inside it really teaches about shadows and the sun coming coming up and going down and they're they're really something to uh start a good conversation with your children and i always loved books and i think books are way better than television television or tablets or cell phones and stuff so and I really want Sarah to have a joy of learning for books from books and as well as Hannah and I can't wait for Hannah to get old enough for me to read to her as well but Sarah she just we read to her every day we read to her in her Bible stories or Bible lessons I mean and we read to her before naps and bedtimes and even free reading I have this presidential book uh, that talks about all the presidents a brief summary and she loves me reading it out loud to her while she plays so sometimes she'll bring me the book to her and ask me to read to her while she plays with her puzzles and it's just it, it's really good i really like doing that if you want to 
check out to see if your county is doing this for y'all's library and y'all's children. Just go to your local library and ask and they'll I'm sure they would know and if not then maybe they could put in a request for it to come to y'all's county. But yeah that's what we did and it, even if you don't get that you can still go to your local library and check out tons of books and just make it a goal. Okay I'm gonna read one or two books every day to my child and it doesn't take long it takes like 10 minutes and and I think they really really benefit from it because um, they start applying it to themselves as well but that's what we did at the library and I'm gonna close out this video and leave a comment below give us a thumbs up it really helps out our channel and I'll see you guys later bye